Girl, he never gave me no damn earrings. He probably gave those to Jennifer. Hey, have you heard the latest scoop on Tiffany Haydish, Common, and Jennifer Hudson? Tiffany Haydish, our favorite queen of comedy, seems to be holding all the cards in the game of love gossip. You know how Common and Jennifer Hudson have been the talk of the town, walking around town together for a good couple of years? Rumor has it that Jennifer Hudson just pulled the rug out from under Common's feet in the messiest, most cringeworthy breakup imaginable. Apparently, Common got down on one knee and popped the question to Jennifer. But instead of the fairy tale ending he probably envisioned, she hit him with a big fat no. Tiffany is not one to mince words or hide her feelings, and let's just say she's been throwing shade at Common like there's no tomorrow. Tiffany Haydish is taking her pettiness game to a whole new level. If you thought she was sassy before, you ain't seen nothing yet. She's like a master of throwing shade and she's just raised the bar. So rewind back to the pandemic era around 2020 to 2021 when the world was in chaos, but love still found a way. Tiffany and Common were in the spotlight with their budding romance. Common tried to smooth things over, claiming their breakup was all about busy schedules and not being able to give the relationship the TLC it deserved. He said something along the lines of, Our love didn't vanish into thin air. We just couldn't give it the attention it needed. But Tiffany wasn't having any of it. She spilled the tea, saying Common blindsided her with a breakup. She even went as far as calling their relationship the healthiest and most fun she'd ever had. Since day one, Tiffany hasn't exactly been shy about her feelings toward the relationship. And her stance hasn't softened one bit. Looks like Common might have just met his match in the dating game. You know, Mr. Smooth Operator himself with a list of celebrity ladies under his belt. Taraji B. Henson, Erica Badu, Serena Williams, Angela Rye, and the list goes on. But it seems like the tables have turned. And it's Jennifer Hudson who's calling the shots now. Let's rewind a bit to how it all started. Jennifer and Common were trying to keep things hush-hush at the beginning, meeting on the set of a movie. Apparently, they've been tight for years, but things took a romantic turn while they were filming in Philadelphia over the summer. Now, Jennifer, being the queen of privacy that she is, tried to brush off the dating rumors. Oh, we're just friends, she said, batting those eyelashes. But come on, Jen, we're not buying it. Paparazzi caught them red-handed on dates even after the cameras stopped rolling. Looks like someone's got some explaining to do. Common even went the extra mile, jetting off to London for the premiere of Jennifer's musical EST Strange Loop. It was as clear as crystal to everyone who laid eyes on them at the London premiere. They were definitely an item. Still, they kept up the game, playing it cool and coy about their relationship status. But you know what they say, truth always finds its way to the surface. And sure enough, they finally came clean, right when Common was a guest on Jennifer's show a few months back. He spilled the beans saying, yes, I'm in a relationship with one of the most beautiful people I've ever met in life. She's smart, she loves God, she's got this real down-to-earth vibe about her, she's talented. But let me tell you, I set my standards pretty high. She had to have an EGOT, she had to win an Oscar for her first movie, she had to get her own talk show. Now that's setting the bar high. And you know what's even more heartwarming? Jennifer, who's usually as private as a vault when it comes to her personal life, was willing to make it public. It made us all feel like their love was rock solid and stronger than ever. According to the latest gossip, Common decided to take the plunge and pop the question. Yep, you heard that right, he got down on one knee and everything. But Jennifer wasn't quite ready to say yes. Well, it seems like she's a bit wary of Common's playboy past, especially since she's been burned by love before. Let's rewind the tape and take a trip down memory lane to unravel the untold story of Jennifer Hudson's past romance with a man named David. And no, we're not talking about just any David. This is the same David who made waves chasing after New York on that reality TV show. So, Jennifer and David's love story began way back in 2007. Before we knew it, on Jennifer's 27th birthday on September 2008, David dropped to one knee and popped the question. They looked like the picture-perfect couple, ready to take on the world together. Just a few weeks after Jennifer said yes, her world was shattered when her brother-in-law committed an unspeakable act, taking the lives of her mother, brother, and nephew. 
It was a nightmare beyond comprehension. But through it all, David stood by her side like a rock, offering her unwavering support and a shoulder to lean on. Later that same year, Jennifer announced that she was expecting a baby. And in 2009, their son David Jr. arrived, bringing a glimmer of light into their lives amidst the darkness. Suddenly, they were a family, a beautiful, unconventional one. Jennifer made some shocking claims alleging that there was a domestic violence involved in the relationship. She accused David of getting aggressive with her on multiple occasions, especially as their relationship started to crumble. David wasn't about to take those accusations lying down. He came out swinging with allegations of his own, claiming that Jennifer had been cheating on him with multiple men in the industry. It got so messy that David even resorted to using their own son as a pawn in their twisted game. Allegedly, he got their son to spy on Jennifer, even going as far as convincing him to record her during one of her studio sessions. Jennifer recounted a chilling incident when David allegedly sent her a threatening message while she was at the studio. She was so frightened that she had to call for security, fearing he might show up and cause trouble. Thankfully, he allegedly didn't make an appearance at the studio, but the nightmare continued when Jennifer returned home. She claimed that David was waiting for her. Allegedly, he became physical, grabbing their son and dragging her around. It was a terrifying incident to say the least. According to David, Jennifer is twisting the situation to gain pity and sympathy from the public, especially with her legion of fans rallying behind her. His lawyer even went on record with TMZ, stating that David vehemently denies each and every allegation made by Hudson. In a bold move, David's lawyer stated that at no point did David physically push Jennifer as she claimed. Instead, his frustration stemmed from what he perceived to be Jennifer's reckless behavior with their son. Apparently, Jennifer thought it was perfectly acceptable to keep their kid at a recording studio into the wee hours of a school night. But David? Well, he just wanted the little one tucked into bed on time, so he'd be fresh as a daisy for school the next day. So, let's set the record straight. According to David, this beef wasn't about jealousy or possessiveness. It was about responsible parenting, plain and simple. And you know who's probably sitting back and enjoying every juicy moment of this love triangle? None other than Tiffany Haydish. According to insiders, she's reveling in the thought of Common getting a taste of his own medicine after allegedly breaking her heart. But fans are surprisingly siding with Jennifer on this one. They're here for her, turning down Common and keeping her guard up. It seems like Common may have a reputation for being a good time, but also a bit of a heartbreaker. As one fan put it, Jennifer Hudson should keep her guard up and her eyes wide open when it comes to Common. So, where do you stand in all of this? Are you Team Common or J-Hood or are you just Team J-Hood all the way? Sound off in the comments below and let's keep this gossip train rolling!